The mixtape all this week features the gadget man himself, Matt Porter of Matt Porter Web Design, our regular gadget man, now choosing tunes for us. Matt, great to see you. And to you as well. How are you, mate? All right. I'm good, yeah. Very good, thank you. Good for you, yeah. Now, you're a man, of course, that we know now is very much involved in the latest technology and all of that. You regularly report for us on the latest by way of gadgetry and all that. Have you always been that guy? For for technology, I suppose I have, actually. When I was at school... I had a um, Commodore VIC-20 hey, um, and old learned days, to program eh? on that. And that was interesting because yeah. the budget for that present was the Commodore VIC-20 on its own without the tape drive. <laughs> oh. So I would spend a lot of time programming and writing programs to do things, yeah. either leaving the VIC-20 switched on. Because yeah. um, if you switched it off, switch that was it. And it. You switch it off and it's gone forever, that was yeah. It. Yeah. So it's a good way of learning to program because you kind of had to memorise <laughs> a lot of what you did or yeah. write it down. Um, so that when you uh, wanted to do it again, you had to retype it all in. So it was a, a painful thing. I bet. Mm-hmm. However, we're not talking about something like writing an equivalent to Microsoft Word. <laughs> you know, there was a very limited amount of memory in a VIC-20, so the programmes were never that long. But it was still a good start. So, so what was it? 10, print, hello. 20 go to 10 that one with 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 commodores it was it was poke 36879 comma 22 or something yeah Uh, we'll talk more about this as the week goes by but we want to find out more about the man himself so matt porter who are you you are you local because i don't get the sense you're not suffolk born are you i was born in hitchin in hertfordshire hertfordshire yeah um of which i lived in that area for around uh 30 32 33 years right um so what then, brought you to Suffolk then then i met um a young lady on uh, an online dating site called uh uday which is long gone yeah um i met her on uday and we got to know each other and fell in love and i then sold my house in Bedfordshire at the time and yeah. moved to Ipswich to be with her. Oh, and how then romantic. we got married yeah. and we had two children yeah. and we're still together. Brilliant. Yeah. It's well, good. that, I mean, it's good to hear of an online success story because they can be frowned upon in, by some people. Certainly, yeah. yeah. And and this was, as usual, I have to jump into something at, right at the beginning of it. <laughs> yeah, right, there you go. <laughs> but yeah. Um, yeah, it was good. So you were one of the first, I reckon, then, because I no doubt you were. You know, that was 2000, right 2002, 2003. Oh, yeah, that's got to be early days. Yeah, that's got to so be a pioneering. It was, it, well, yeah, I'm pioneer when it comes pioneering to Pioneering romance. There yes. you go. That's so there brilliant. you go. That's what brought me to Mind it. You, your missus must have been on it as well. So I suspect she's a bit of a tech head as well. She's not, actually. She's oh. she's not massively... Oh, so she's not a tech head. She's not as enthusiastic as I am. Yeah. Um, yeah. But she does do... Um, ro- we run Matt Porter Web Design together. Yeah. So she's, she builds websites and things like that. Oh, there you go. Um, yeah. Although she's not um, as deep down. She won't go out and buy a gadget just because it's just been released by mm, somebody. Absolutely not. No, she's not interested. <laughs> well, you and I will her do phone, that. Her, her smartphone battery will last for days because, because <laughs> yeah, she doesn't use it that much. That's how you can much. tell, right? Yeah. That's how exactly. you can tell. When you moved to Suffolk, was there a concern with your technology mind that you're moving to a place that's not, shall we say, renowned for technology it wasn't at the forefront i guess i guess not country. and and what was what was more um Pop and bt of course risk oh, of course yeah yeah. Uh, yeah we've got i mean it turns out i ended up having an office on on that campus oh, well, there for, you go. for a number of years and yeah, yeah. they were it's a superb place right. um and not many people know of of what really you know how how, how vibrant a, a sort of technology community it is really there. is yeah, um, yeah but yeah. when i came here actually i handed my notice in for my full-time job in hertfordshire and sold my house and i came here and started matt porter web design when mm. i arrived which was madness you know i didn't know anybody <laughs> didn't know anyone in business yeah and it was um uh, uh, Maybe a daft move, but yeah, I'm but still going. But it worked going. out. <laughs> Eventually, it worked yeah, out it did, yeah. beautifully, yeah. yeah. Um, so you're you're here for good. You're in the county for good. You've come here this week to choose some songs for us. You're going to start with the beloved, the satellite map. For what reason? Um, this was a, a peculiar thing. This this track came out in 1996, and at that time, I was house sitting for somebody right. in Stevenage, and during the time of house sitting was Euro '96, right. which was England played absolutely amazingly. Yeah, um, it did. It was one of the most fantastic <laughs> yeah. tournaments I think oh, I've that ever Gascoigne seen. Gascoigne goal. Gascoigne oh, with the Coles, come on. Um, yeah. uh, Sheringham, Shearer, yeah. all the classic. Um, we players. were supposed to win that, weren't we? It was an, we an amazing, an amazing. 
amazing uh, um, tournament. Yeah. But I was house sitting there, so I obviously I remember um, watching the games in this person's living right. room. And then every time we scored, I think we played we played um, the Netherlands and beat them four one. Yeah. And every time we scored, I kept ringing my mate up and screaming <laughs> down the phone at him. But at the time, they also had satellite TV with MTV there, yeah. Yeah. Um, and I was watching that and hadn't watched that before. And this particular video for um, satellite by the beloved came on and uh, it's quite memorable if you ever watch it on youtube i think you probably can mm. um it's a quite a memorable video uh quite groundbreaking i guess and uh, the song's fantastic as well um and i actually have contact it, vaguely with um john marsh who's the singer of the beloved oh right um, by being a member of the beloved fan group on facebook <laughs> he he, oh, he he regularly posts on there yeah. um, and it's quite geeky i guess um yeah. but it's a great track really good